Oh, it's just an Elvent as a logo. Welcome, I'm Hawaiian Shirt Papa. Sometimes with others, I visit a variety of antique, vintage, and thrift shops within Southern Ontario. Sometimes we don't get anything. Come tour with me vicariously. Hello, and welcome to another tour by Hawaiian Shirt Papa. This time it's the National Thrift their store on Keel Street, just south of Lawrence. If you're in Toronto, you would know the location generally. In fact, this used to be a Value Village store at one time. Quite some time ago, but nonetheless. Some of their hard goods I've shown you just inside the door. Yeah, we'll see the books in a bit, a bit later in the video. That their hard goods and their sporting goods, electrical cords, shoes. Then we're into the handbags, backpacks, purses. We've gone off to the opposite end of the store, or the side of the store, I should say. There's a wall display, so you can get a little bit better time of looking at it instead of being in motion. Uh, this this suede fringe backpack uh, actually is very nice for a suede backpack with fringe. And the price is pretty reasonable for consider, considering. Then they had some of these other bags. Some other closer or still shots for you to be able to check on the purses. I like to look around at them. I don't particularly know all of the brand names that people might be looking for. That red one is the one with the elephant in the front splash here. And in this image, it looks black, although it's golden color. I tried to look up the logo, couldn't find anything. That doesn't mean that I always find things though. These are the showcases they had. I'm not sure if they had a Hawaiian shirt there or it was something with a similar fabric design and on the first part of the glass case and they've got the hat some of their hats at least are there we're back to the bags there was quite a few they're separated by a, a wall bump out and then we're in just shoes they just feel like they keep going on and on there's uh then there's the other there's more shoes on the on the other wall there. Now we're going to go into the clothing. There's some more hats and accessories here on the end end of the aisles. For example, belts, some featured items that they somebody's placed there. Here's the long sleeves. Sometimes we find one in long sleeves, so I've started to look there as well. I've been caught off guard and in one video I found a vintage shop selling the long sleeve Hawaiian shirts. Potential business attire it's a little more demure it's still busy for average use in North America where they're looking for a plain shirt the pink flamingo and we might see some stills of some of those a bit later on So 
some fabrics, sheets, linens. And here we go, we start to see some of the Hawaiian shirts. Nice Canadian th theme on this one. I believe I picked it up, so I've got something for Canada Day. I know I have one from another one that uh, I know from an earlier video. It's quite a selection of them here. Very pleased to find them. I picked up two or three. That was a Nautica. Uh, the price certainly is uh, n nothing to be ashamed of. There's an ice n another one. This is more of an evening attire, in my opinion. They've marked it as women's, but it was found in the men's. Uh, always double check with that kind of thing with the buttoning. There's the Nautica. And we have this one here. And a still for it. It's a nice design. Good color colors. This one's uh, a bit different in colors. It's like a pink, orangey pink. Then we have this one. It actually says made in Hawaii. That one has a slightly higher price tag, but I'd say it would be worth it. And here we go. We kind of take a look at some of the hard goods. turn around and we're back into some of the men's clothing. They are right near each other at the end of the aisle. And then you get into the books here. Some of the music. I'm not familiar with all the artists. There's a certain genre I know a bit better. I'm aware of Neil Diamond. And the prices are pretty good. 99 cents for vinyl records. This is a bit newer than my era. And some of the, they also do the bag goods. They have some glassware there. Some of the toys are bagged up. So this is the other side. There's toys here. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. We'd appreciate if you subscribe. Give us a thumbs up for, for the video. And if you'd like to be notified, put a mark on the bell. Thanks a lot, folks. Bye-bye.